Hola me vintage beauties. It's another video with your girl vintage sister and today we are going to be doing a vintage jewelry haul and when I tell y'all I got pieces galore and guess how much it cost? Free zero zero nilch nada. I didn't pay a dime for any of this stuff. Okay, so how did I do that? My mother-in-law gave me all this stuff you guys. So, I'm going to start with what I have on. These gorgeous, it looks like a leaf. They're gold plated. They seem heavy. These are the lightest earrings I've ever worn. These earrings right here, I'm going to show you. I got these from Aldo. These are heavy and tug on my ear. And they hurt. I can't wear them all day. These are so lightweight, it feels like nothing is in it. So, it sounds like 10. So, yeah, I wore these to work today. So I got that. Then let's go to this ring. Gorgeous, gorgeous ring. Real gold. I got this also. So I wore that today. Then let's go to some bracelets. Right here. Really, really beautiful colors for the fall. It's like that pop of orange and that yellow with the darker color. So this is a gorgeous bracelet. Then I got this one. I don't think this one is vintage, actually. I think I had this a long time ago. This is not vintage, you guys. Oops. I don't want that. I have this vintage piece. So you can tell the vintage jewelry, the costume jewelry, is lightweight. It's not really heavy. And the clasp. Look at this clasp. So it goes in like this, and it goes in between this little part. So this lets you know that this is a vintage piece. And then look at the little stone and look at the design in the jewelry. This is really pretty, you guys. So that and then this one right here. This is gorgeous right here. So look at how that looks. So this is a nice little bracelet. So it's cute. It almost looks like a watch. Really cute. So, yeah, next let's go to this little piece right here. We'll go to my necklaces last. So, these, I think, I don't know what they were, but these would be cute little brooches. And they got the little purple stone. You can make this into an earring, but this is a little too big for me. You can make it into a necklace. Um, you can put it on a belt, wear it as a brooch. It's just like a nice little piece to accentuate something. You know, here's a clip on earring. Very cute. Look at this. Oh, okay. So here's some clip on earrings. Now, clip on earrings sometimes annoy me, but these are pretty cute. So you see that it has really beautiful colors. Like the the main color is uh, like a burgundy-ish, reddish. I'm trying to really get y'all to see it, okay? So I have those right there. I like these. These are cute. These are some more clip-ons, which you know is a vintage thing. Um, but I don't know where the other one is. So I'm a little disappointed about that because I like this. But I don't know where the other earring is. So some of these I couldn't find the match. Here goes another one. It's missing a stone. But I don't know where the match is. So that's a... Here is, let's see, here is another brooch, super cute. This is like a statement piece. So say you want to wear, it's a little tangled. Say you want to wear all black and you just want to pin this here to give you a pop of color or put it on a jacket or make it be like the clasp to close a jacket. That'll be super cute. This is a microphone on air. So this is just a um, like a piece to hang from some jewelry. I wouldn't hang it from a choker, but you know it'll be cute hanging from some jewelry. Um, here goes some more matching. Oh yeah, here go another brooch. I like brooches. You can use them to clasp together things. You can even put it on a choker. Look how cute that will look, you guys. Look how fancy that is. Put it to the side. You can put brooches on chokers. That is super cute and fancy. Um, let's see. Here is another brooch. Some kind of bird. 
which is super cute with the stone. Hey, that stone matches this. Oh, they go together. Ha <laughs> ha. So that's cute. I got brooches galore, y'all. Here's another one. This one is really pretty. It's like an ivory color. This is a hairpin. Not right there. Let's put it right. Oh, it's kind of heavy. So look at this hairpin. This is cute. Oh, I like that, you guys. So this is a cute little hairpin. Um, look at this ring. So these are the type of rings that they sell at uh, Forever 21 now. You know these rings that go over both fingers? So look how cute that is. Let me take this one off so I can just really be the focal point. That's cute. Let me see. Oh, it's even cuter on this one. So this is super cute. Look at that. It almost just looks like it's like a floating ring. It's really cute. Really, really cute. Then... This is another piece that goes on, like, it's for a necklace, but this will actually look cute on a choker. So you can easily attach that to a choker. Here's a nice little ring, a vi another vintage ring. Super cute. Um, two more rings. Here's one with, like, a little green stone. This one's okay. But it's vintage. And then here's this little tiny one, which is cute. So that's pretty much it for my little knickknacks. Oh, and here, yep, that's pretty much it for my knickknacks. So let's move on to these necklaces. Let me just put this stuff up because I have a lot of necklaces to show you guys, okay? I am so excited. I love vintage jewelry. Um, let me do an update on my Miss A jewelry. It's cheap. At the end of the day, it was a dollar for a reason. I can go to like outdoor swap meets, garage sales, things of that nature, and get vintage quality pieces for a dollar. If I'm going to get modern costume jewelry, it's going to come from like Forever 21 or other little boutiques because it doesn't make sense to spend $35 on 35 pieces that don't last at all like I at least want to be able to wear it throughout the day without me turning into the Grinch because I'm turning green um you know so let's go to these necklaces look at this first one like these are statement pieces these are not just everyday let's wear this this is meant for if you go into some type of themed event because it's an elephant. So this is more a tribal type of piece. But it's still nice. Like I would never wear these big dangly earrings with this. Because it's clashy. So I would you know. I may not even wear earrings. And I would have my hair pulled up. And it would have to. Like it would have to be something. An occasion. This is not an everyday. Oh let me pull this out for work. Like I wouldn't wear that to work. So that one has an elephant. And this one has a swan. So this one has the swans on it. So same concept. This is vintage. How do you know? Look at the clasp. So you twist it. Those are vintage type clasps. So this is definitely a themed type of item. Here's another one. I don't understand this. Honestly, I don't get that, why that's there. But this is another one where I feel like it, it goes, it's not an everyday type of piece to me. Not for me. It may be for others, but to me, this is not an everyday type of piece. So, yeah. Look. Look at this. These are, these are brass look, bronze, brass looking. Um, very lightweight though. Once again, the twist clasp lets you know the era. It is not of today. Um, I'm not sure what that era is. I'm thinking it's the 60s maybe. 
Um, let me know if you know the the twisted um the twist kind that you twist to unsnap. Let me know. But this is cute. This can be worn on like a fun date night. Nothing like it's not a fancy piece. This is super cute. I was trying to see if this is anything, but this is another vintage piece. You just look at the details. So you see how this one connects? Let's you know it's a vintage piece. Super cute though, it's like some pearls. And the pearls have like little dents in them, which is cute. So this could be cute. You could definitely dress that up. Here is like a small choker. Another clasp that lets you know it is a vintage piece. It's a little longer than a choker though, but it's a simple piece. So I like this, like simple elegance. It has the initials SC on them. I can't barely see what it says. Um, look at this, you guys. Definitely a statement piece. I'm mad because it got chipped right there. I'm pretty sure you can get that fixed. But this is definitely a vintage piece of costume jewelry. Um, just the design. It has the regular clasp. So I'm thinking it's more of the 80s. Still considered vintage. 90s is retro because we're in the... 2000s, 80s is um, considered vintage. 90s and on is retro. Well, 80s is old school. I'll put it that way. Look at this. See, this is what I'm talking about. Coming to these vintage pieces. This is a summer piece. Like, and this is definitely vintage. Look at the clasp. The original piece where it's supposed to go, um, I guess, broke. But you could just clasp it right here. No one would really see the back anyway, but this is cute. Wear this with a cute summer dress. You know what I'm saying? So that's super cute. Um, this is a cute, like, pearl-esque. Pearl-esque, but it needs the clasp. But I like how it's kind of roped. So this is a cute little vintage necklace. Here's another one. It reminds me of like a snake. <laughs> oh, excuse me, guys. I don't know. It's like a snake type necklace to me. And then this is like the 80s, like Run DMC. I don't even know. Oh, it is a necklace. And look at the class. But this doesn't necessarily mean that this is vintage because I have some jewelry that I got that has a clasp like this. But this is so Run DMC. Hip hop. Uh, uh. If you want to be an 80s hip hop artist. Uh, uh, uh. What you say. And actually <clears throat> these earrings clashing is so 80s. So you can wear these. These are not 80s earrings. Oh, excuse me guys. This is not 80s earrings though. I'm feeling sick. I'm going to make a whole nother video on what I've been going through emotionally behind this pregnancy it's gonna be a whole nother video so stay tuned for that but this is like a 80s mm, 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 old school hip-hop feel you will wear bangles not these like these 60 earrings 60s in hip-hop no okay dress it up now so let me see almost done two more pieces then i have this which is cute. This will look really sexy on. This is like a sexy piece with a low cut dress. Oh, so good, so good now. And then last but not least, this little piece. Which is cute. So this was just a pretty lengthy. Let me put all my stuff up. Pretty lengthy vintage jewelry haul which I feel like I got so I'm tired I don't feel good you guys I feel like I got some wonderful pieces in this haul comment down below if you have any questions don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I can't wait to see you in the next video until next time vintage beauties it's your girl vintage sister peace and blessings deuces